Hi everybody, Alex Aplow here from Expert Forex. And in this video, I'm gonna do my best to give you an idea of the relationship between leverage and margin. And why most countries are trying to reduce the leverage that allowed to, to Forex trading clients. Now the easiest way that I thought I'd show you is actually a practical example of what happens. So I'm going to open a series of accounts with different leverage and we'll see what margin the broker asks for. And we're going to base it on the Euro USD. And one of the things you need to be aware of is when you're using a currency uh, like the like the US, USD, you need to know the specifications of that particular broker. Now, how you do that is you, you put your cursor on that currency, you click, uh, right click, you then click on specifications, and it will say that in order to trade that currency you uh, on a main lot, you need to buy a hundred thousand dollars worth of that currency that's what it's saying there uh, and it says the margin percentage is a hundred percent some brokers have smaller percentages this one has a hundred percent so um, when a trade is open a hundred percent of the contract size needs to be financed now that might be so strange a lot of people don't realize they're actually trading hundred thousand dollar contracts when they're trading main lots but I'll explain that a bit further so at the moment we don't have a, a an account open so I'm going to go and open one so I click on file open an account and here we are and this is insta forex uh, and I'm going to just going to load the demo account so on we go we are going to open a new demo and it brings up my details I'm going to say well, let's run them all on a ten thousand dollar account keep it all the same and I'm going to go and why I'm using this account is that they give you such a wide range of leverage. So I'm going to go for a thousand to one leverage. Very high, it's most probably the highest leverage that you can get. And we click on a thousand to one. We have a ten thousand dollar account. We agree and we say next and it opens an account for us. And we finish. So now we have a $10,000 account with, with a thousand to one leverage. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to actually do a deal. So here's the euro. I'm going to do it on main lots just to illustrate the point of how margins work. And, and I'm just going to enter a sell deal for, for argument's sake. So we enter a sell deal. And we say okay so now we in a cell so let's have a look what has happened with this thousand dollar leverage account and i'm going to go to trade open so there's our trade that's open we've opened it with a one main lot and what it's telling us is it says we started with a thousand ten thousand dollar account um we this broker has taken twelve dollars and 13 cents as margin and if you look at the price of the euro at the moment it is 1213 so it's basically taken the price uh, and it has taken that as a factor to calculate the margin that's required to trade this deal what that means is that that 12 dollars gets taken out of your account and it doesn't belong to you anymore. It belongs to the broker while this deal is on. That is your part of the deal that is being financed by your own money. The rest of the deal is financed by the broker's money. So it is saying, all right, so your free margin is actually uh, the equity, which is that loss that we're running right now, the $4 loss, less the margin so in your account in reality you only have uh, you have 16 dollars less now that's on a thousand to one leverage so let's drop down to 100 to one leverage and the easy thing to do there is all you do is you do the same thing you go and open an account There we are, and we'll open a $10,000 account. And this time we're going for 100 to 1 leverage, or 1 to 100, 100 to 1, same thing. And we say next, and 
the new account is now open. So now the old account is gone and we have a new account here and we will just leave that one alone for a while uh, and we'll click off auto trading. So now we go and have a look. Okay, so now we've got this. So let's go and put a deal in. Now remember, the first one was $12.13. So, um, and we're going to do a euro sell again and we sell it. And we say, okay, now look what's happened. Now the broker wants more of our money. Now the broker wants $121.33, which is again a factor of the current price. And if you look again, your free margin or your actual account balance is now reduced by the loss that you're running, the $1 loss, plus the margin that you have. So... That is why a lot of people can't understand. Sometimes they are actually positive in their deals and they get margin calls. It's because that margin gets taken out of your account. The broker says, hey, you don't have that money in your account anymore. And uh, if you trade too many open deals, you run into serious problems with that. So there's the 100 to 1 leverage. So let's go further. So let's go and open an account with less leverage. Open an account. We back there we say yes we say yes so this time let's go to the extreme let's go to the levels where the leverage is only 20 to 1 now those are the proposed leverages the most extreme leverages that a lot of the countries are proposing and i'm going to just show you that so we click this now we've got an account of 10,000 with a leverage of 20 to 1 so let's go and have a look at what happens if we trade that account okay so here's our new account and remember the sequence now it was twelve dollars for the thousand to one it was 121 dollars for the hundred to one let's go and see what the uh, margin is for the 20 so theoretically it should be uh, five times the 120 it should be about 600 dollars let's just let's just check this so we go sell and we say okay and we go and have a look at the trade and yes uh, my mental calculations were correct so what's happening now is the broker is now taking 600 dollars out of your account it's now saying your free margin is is now nine thousand 387 because it's taking that small loss that's already running there and that is actually what is available in your account for trading it's not your balance less the loss that you're making right now which is your equity no it's your equity less your margin and that is what is available uh, to you now if you opened a number of deals let's say you opened 12 or 13 deals you would run out of margin and your deals could by some fluke be positive but you'd run out of margin and the mo the broker will uh, instigate a margin call now the the good thing about margin people think it's the worst thing in the world when you have a margin call that margin that the broker takes out of your account to finance the deals when the deals are closed as a result of the margin call that money actually comes back to you okay so let's summarize the learning points from this video firstly the higher your leverage the more deals you can in fact open because uh it, if the broker is only taking 12 dollars per deal for margin you can open a huge amount of deals you on that particular leverage when it gets smaller the amount of deals become even smaller but when it gets to the 50 to 1 or 20 to 1 leverage you really need to watch your deals you cannot open many deals and and these calculations are uh, ignoring losses on the open deals as well as spreads so this is just a rough indication of the impact of leverage on margin and the impact of margin on the number of deals that you can open. The other learning point from this video is that you need to start creating a habit of watching your free margin and not your equity only. 
so this is your balance which is uh, uh, your trades plus closed trades the equity is your balance less open trades so equity can be higher than balance or can be lower than balance margin is what the broker is taken out of your account to finance your open deals and you need to look at free margin which is equity uh, less the margin and that's your free and that if that goes negative you will get a margin call but as we said earlier it's not the end of the world you do get your margins back from your open deals when you do have a margin call so the US already has low leverage uh, the UK and Europe has, has low leverage and Australia is moving into low leverage in the next month or two so what is the answer the answer is that if you are forced into using low leverage you need either larger amounts in your account or you need to change your strategy so that you don't have strategies that require lots of open deals if you're trading one deal at a time not a problem low leverage is is definitely not a problem but if you have an ea for instance like the grit rent multiplier or the make money ea that really makes a lot of money because they open a lot of deals and um then you certainly can't trade it with a 20 to 1 leverage account you you need to have 100 to 1 or even a thousand to 1 if you possibly can get that so that's all it means it's not the end of the world to have low leverage you just have to adapt to that your trading style use eas that only open one deal at a time and that type of thing again watch your free margin number that's the one to watch at all times now one last solution that has happened over the last couple of months is and in fact most of our EA traders have moved over to one cent accounts and the one cent accounts available through InstaForex are in particularly quite useful because not only do they provide one cent account facilities which allows you to trade cents as if they're dollars they also provide fixed spreads now fixed spreads is a, a critical element when trading forex robots so it's a com ideal combination for our clients they have uh, one cent accounts and they have these fixed spreads and that is the solution to really good uh, results when using trading robot please do use the link shown and the link will also be available in the commentary and in the description of the video i hope you've learned something from this video it's been a just a little bit of a playing around video to just show you give you an idea a feel how leverage impacts your margin and how margin impacts the number of deals that you can open in your account from me alex deploy cheerio